So you've been re riding your e-bike and you want to charge it, but you're looking for a portable solution. You can take a car, van, RV, camping, van lifing. Well, you need your bike and its charger is an AC brick like this Suron one. But if you've got a solar panel, you're going to charge it with sunlight. You need a 200 watt panel. Rigid panel is better than a folding panel, in my opinion, much more reliable. And an EB70. EB70 is awesome. It's got a 1000 watt inverter on it. And you can plug it into the solar using the included uh, MC4 connector. So the MC4 connectors from the solar panel will go into the socket here on the top left and it will start charging the battery inside the EB70. Right now it's showing 80, it'll increase, it's a 200 watt panel, it's looking for the maximum power point, 102. The fan came on, the cooling fan. It's a bit cloudy today, probably won't get the full 200 watts, but we'll get over 100 at least going in, 107. It's going to go up probably, but in the meantime we can plug in and turn on our AC, the uh, charger for the sewer on has started up the fan there, and now we've got power coming in and we've got power coming out. 102 watts coming in and 649, 650 going out. So it's passing through some of the charge and the e-bike is charging. Started at 64 and it's just already gone up to 65% on the little tiny scale there which is typical for Suron I wish it was on the display on the handlebar but it's down there on top of the battery showing 65 percent and it's charging from an EB70 so this is a good way if you've got a van and you're traveling with your bikes to have a solar generator to charge your e-batteries